Christmas is all about. Guys, it's snowing. It's December the 1st. I'm gonna open my calendar. Let's see what we've got here. So I'm in my Christmas dramas. I've literally been wearing these for ages though, not gonna lie. <laughs> I can't believe it's literally snowing on December the 1st, like that's so cute, I can't stand this up anywhere. It rarely happens, so let's be honest. So exciting! It's the 1st of December and I've decided that I'm going to do Vlogmas this year. So basically if you don't know what that is, it's you either post like a vlog or a like a video every single day of December leading until the 24th yeah I just thought it would be super fun to do and I know this Christmas and December is going to be so special so I just want to you know take you guys along and yeah just make the most of it really I don't know if you can hear the music, but it's changing my earrings. Oh yeah, I got Christmas earrings, so I'm gonna put them in. Well, I got these. Yeah, basically, I'm gonna go out in the snow like very soon because you know that might be the only snow I see this year. I don't know if it'll snow in the UK this year. They're cute. So, what am I doing? Yeah, I need to get a new one. Mm -hmm. I need my hair to dry because I can't really go out in the snow with wet hair. So that's an issue. It feels like December the 1st, actually. If that makes any sense. Look, it's probably starting to set up. Just finishing my cup of tea and um, now we're gonna we're gonna go out in the snow. Ah, what am I on? But the floor isn't like it's not setting on the floor yet, but it's all around there. And there's the staring on the trees. The snow has actually set on the beach. That's so cool. Oh my god, guys, my hands are so cold. Like, I'm actually worried I'm gonna get frostbite. Yeah, we actually took some pics, some snow pics, so that was nice, but now we're walking back as fast as we can because it's so cold i'm in mega image well actually do you know what it's actually called mega image which i was pretty sad to find that out what's that is that a... that's cool I'm back it's absolutely freezing so my hair actually never my hair actually never dried but i wore a hat so should be fine. But I need to wash my face too because wearing a mask is great for my skin. The Christmas dramas are back on. I need to make a hot chocolate. Literally every time I try and pour the hot milk into there, it always spills every single time. I'm just gonna chill now. Watching this American TV series where people basically make Christmas food. <laughs> It's pretty good, not gonna lie. I'm just gonna eat my roll. Dave's just editing one of the photos that he took of me. A little sneak peek. So I've literally just been chilling this whole time and it's just getting darker and darker. It's actually still snowing, but it's still not like setting loads. I've been going to the gym, as you probably know, but it was shut. It was shut 
at the weekend and then Monday and Tuesday so today it's shut but I can go tomorrow which is good. I've literally got so many plans for this vlogmas. It's gonna be so good. Tomorrow I'm gonna make some Christmas cupcakes. I'm so excited for that. And I'm gonna be going back to the UK soon, which I'm absolutely buzzing for. Like I haven't seen my mum and dad in like four months because obviously they haven't been able to come here because of the virus otherwise they would have been here so it's gonna be so good and i can't wait to see my brother and my niece and nephew and my nan so exciting i'm gonna be vlogging all my time at home with my family at christmas and i just know it's gonna be incredible so i can't wait to vlog it yeah so i literally fly back on the 7th of december which isn't long at all oh my god it's literally First today, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, like six days. Oh my god, I need to pack. <laughs> That's gonna be a whole another thing. Although I'm not actually gonna take that much back because I just don't need to, because literally all of, my, pretty much all of my clothes are still in the UK. Which is why like, I have very limited clothes here. Like I was thinking about that the other day. Because of what I do, I'm traveling at different places and different points of my life. I can't until I'm older and I'm settled somewhere, like I can't really take loads of clothes and stuff with me. So I can't really buy loads of clothes where I'm currently living at. So what I was thinking, I just don't feel like I can fully dress as my actual style because I can't just keep buying the clothes because then I, I just won't be able to take them back home. Yeah, I've just got to work with what I've got at the minute. But yeah, I was thinking about that the other day. Also, I've been watching I'm a Celeb. So we've, because obviously we're in Romania, we have to, we've bought like the ITV subscription thing. And we watch it like the day afterwards it comes out. So we're like a day delayed. But yeah, I'm actually really loving it this year. My favourites are Vernon, Mo, Jordan, Shane, Beverly. That's it. They're my favourites. So, yeah, I really don't know who's going to win. I do think it will be either Mo, Sh Vernon or Jordan, I think. I think it will be either them three. At first, I thought Shane was going to win, but now I don't think so, so much. Because there was, like, that little thing with him and AJ. And to be fair, like, I didn't know whether it was going to be as good as, like, the jungle. Because, obviously, they're in a castle now. But, actually, they've done it so well. It just feels like exactly the same show. They're just in a different place. I will be watching that later, which I'm very excited for. Stacey Solomon, I love this woman. If you don't follow her on Instagram, I recommend giving her a follow. She puts on like the nicest stories. And this is like her shop on Amazon because she does like loads of DIY things and she's so creative and good at it. My gingerbread socks, yeah. They molt absolutely everywhere. Look, there's stuff there. It's all over here. It's all over here. I literally thought I took all of the fluff out, but apparently not. Yeah, look, it's on the floor here. Oh my god, it's here. It's literally everywhere. It's all in the shower. <laughs> it's in the shower. It's just a complete utter mess. It's still snowing as well. It's not enough to set though. I know I keep saying it, but I wish it was going to set. I literally just cannot wait to go back to the UK. Like, I'm so excited to have a prep. It's ridiculous. I am dreaming about prep these days. Because before I came to Romania, like, I just, my love just grew for it even more. I actually need to text my mum and ask her if I'll have an advent calendar at home. Because I have one here, but then obviously I can't take it all the way to the UK because it's actually huge. For dinner, I got this pizza. It's vegan and it's plant-based. Because I'm trying to eat dairy-free at the minute because I'm just trialing a few things out. So, yeah. I'm going to try this. I've never, ever, ever had a vegan pizza before because normal pizza tastes amazing. But, yeah. I've got to try this one. Um... But it looks pretty good, like the picture looks good, but like, yeah, let's just see what it looks like when I take it out of the packaging. I'm not even gonna lie, that doesn't look bad at all. What's going in? That literally didn't take long at all. Literally like 10 minutes. 
That looks so good. Oh, look! Today is your chance to win treats from home. Oh. That plant-based pizza was actually so good. I'm literally shocked. I did not think it would be like that. So I'm definitely going to be getting that again. <clears throat> now I've just got Outpro chocolate hazelnut ice cream and i'm not joking it tastes so good in there i've got the outpro chocolate swirl which is like vanilla with chocolate sauce and it's not as good but this one is like so good i've got chocolate ice cream in my mouth i'm a celeb just finished and beverly went which i'm sad about and then victoria went it was a really good episode actually I'm glad Russell didn't go because I really like him. He's really nice. Um, yeah, but now I'm just going to do some more editing. I'm editing this video and then it's going to be up tomorrow morning. So, yeah. I've literally got so many layers on. I've got crop top on, this top on, this top and this top. I mean, it's not even that cold in here, but I don't know. I just feel cosy. I'm just going to brush my teeth. Does this ever happen to you guys? So, my part in is bang centre in the middle, right? And then just like gradually as time goes on, it just moves more and more to the left. Look, it's so off centre now. And I don't even know how that happened. Maybe like when I get out of the shower, I don't like put it back into its proper state. It's so weird. And then it's so difficult to actually get it back to how it was. Yeah, I think that's a bit better, isn't it? Oh, I don't know. Oh, I literally used to have my part in literally here. And then I changed it. I'm getting my hair done when I go back to the UK. Finally, which I can't wait to have done because it's been ages, literally, since the summer which is, so it's way overdue, like, look how much my hair's grown, all of that, like, that much, so at least I'm happy that it's starting to grow now, because I don't know if you guys know, but, like, my hair just takes so long to grow, so, like, I've never, ever in my life had, like, a massive bit cut off, I've only ever had it trimmed, and it's taken me my whole life to grow it to here, so it is finally growing now, which is good. This is literally like my third time doing this today. I just can't deal with, with my eyebrows are like going down, do you know what I mean? I don't like that. And this thing is a lifesaver, it's so good. It, it's on the other end, it's actually got like an actual eyebrow pencil, it's from Benefit, but this side's an absolute lifesaver. Fourth time. <laughs> I just washed my face and now that it's gone down. Dad! Wave. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, the snow is starting to set now. How exciting. But it might rain tonight, so actually it might just end up going tomorrow morning. Bakers, you have less than 30 minutes remaining. I forgot to tell you this story. So, basically, we went to this park this morning first, where, like, the benches were and stuff. <laughs> and... Because we were the only two in that park at that point, right? And this big wild dog just comes running towards us. And I started to, like, panic. Like, my... Because you just don't know, like, what these wild dogs are going to do. So I was thinking the worst. Um, and I was, like, stressing out, panicking, like, running off and stuff. And obviously because I was panicking, the dog w wanted to chase me more so as i'm like panicking around the dog's like chasing me more and more and i'm stressing out and then i'm like standing on the benches and the dog's following me and i was just so stressed because obviously like dave just w wasn't really phased so he just stood there and then the dog didn't bother him do you know what i mean but it was so scary dave was like telling me to be calm and stuff and then the dog won't you know he won't then i like put my hand out just to like show him that you know it's i'm nice and he can like sniff my hand so he sniffed my hand 
so then we saw that he wasn't gonna bite me but then we the dog was still like following us and like because i think obviously it wanted food so then we like left the park crossed over the road the dog is following us over the road we cross back the other way over the road again the dog's still following us so we're like what do we do we're walking down the street even more and then eventually we saw some people across the road again and so we crossed over to them hoping that the dog would see us with other people and then maybe like go to them people but luckily the dog stayed on the other side of the road um so then we just walked off a long long way and we ended up walking around and then we ended up going back to that park later on and we never saw the dog again so yeah, yeah that, that's that but it was very stressful we're gonna watch a christmas film now i'm not sure which one we're gonna watch but we've got a few on the list but yeah i've watched quite a few so far maybe in another video soon i'll talk about some christmas films because that's just what we like at christmas time and then i'll just go to bed in a really nice december the first hope you enjoyed my first ever vlogmas day one i sure did enjoy filming i believe it snowed that was definitely a highlight please if you want to follow my vlogmas then be sure to subscribe and like this video <laughs> What is going on? I'm just doing handstands. Um, I will be seeing you very soon for Vlogmas Day 2 tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys. Although it's been said many times, many ways, Merry Christmas.